Good evening everybody, how are you all? It's that time again for my little Friday night woofing, uh, just to have a little chat with you all, see how you're all getting on and everything like that. Um, I'm streaming uh, from my laptop so I can't see if anybody's there. If you do have any comments I should be able to see those um, according to this, so um, just pop a note below if you do have any questions. Um, so I've got a couple of things that I thought I'd chit chat about today. Um, first of all is those of you that may have been following me a little bit on Facebook this week now I've been a little bit quiet. Um, one of my dog, dogs had um, an operation. He was uh, castrated, sort of last minute kind of decision and choice um, having to have that done, uh, especially at such a difficult time for the bats. Um, but he was starting to, I was starting to have some problems with him um, since the arrival of Alan. Um, and it, it literally came, it was all down to testosterone ultimately at the end of the day. Um, I discussed it thoroughly with the vet, we went through a number of options. Um, but ultimately at the end of the day, the, the best decision was to uh, remove beans is beans at the end of the day. So um, it's taken, he had that operation on Tuesday um, and it's taken today, so Friday, for him to start being a little bit more normal. So he's wagged his tail today, he's got out, up out of bed and he's not been crying all day long. So it's it's been pretty hard going the last few days. I've literally been spending all the last three days on the sofa with him, just holding him and hugging him while he's been crying. Um, I've been sleeping on the living room floor for the week now, which I now can't do anymore. My back is absolutely shot. Um, I've been in so much pain today that I can't do it for him anymore. So I, thankfully I've got him over the worst of it. Um, but I know lots of other people have been having trouble with their dogs this week. So wishing all those other pups that have had operations this week both expected. Hi, Amanda. Um, both expected and unexpected. Um, I wish all your puppies the very best of health, especially Skip. Especially Skip. Crikey, Skip. You really did a number on yourself this week, didn't you? That that certainly is very special, and I, I'm wishing you a very speedy recovery. Um, and Jack, Jack, oh my goodness, Denise, I don't know how you're coping, coping, um, coping with poor Jack as well. Yeah, I, I, it had that it had to be done, Tish, had to be done. He is going to be fine. Hello, Wendy, how is everybody? Um, so yeah, that's why I've been a bit quiet this week. Um, basically, my puppy needed me, um, and. Uh, as, despite having him sort of in the office a couple of times this week, um, he's he's still not been happy with that. So it's it's just been so sofa cuddles and mum time basically for him. Um, I just wanted to thank everybody that came along to my um, webinar. Um, when did I do that? I can't remember now. I think it was last last week. My top three boredom busters webinar. Um, thank you all for coming along and supporting me during that one. That was my first sort of proper live webinar sort of thing so it was a little bit technical for me but i think it it went all right and i'm, I'm really pleased you enjoyed that um you can get some too soon laura i promise i promise as soon as this is all over you can come on over and have some sofa cuddles um so thank you for coming and joining in that uh, webinar if anybody missed the webinar um those of you that had free access to it um just let me know if you want to catch up on it again um, anybody that hasn't seen it and didn't get the uh, free access link, um, I, for, just for this weekend now, um, it's 50% off, so only £3, um, just to help get us through these last portions of lockdown, because hopefully that's soon going to start to ease. It, it's got to, really. So I'm hoping that um, soon I'm going to be able to get back out and get, get out to work, because I suppose I am actually an outdoor business, and I, I'm hoping that that's not going to be too long. So, um, so while you can, get that um three top board and busters um webinar for just three pounds um it just goes through it's only a 15 minute long little webinar but it just goes through my top three and one little bonus um board and busters that are, are my go-to just for my dogs that are my absolute favorites i've also arranged um for everybody in the group this week um uh, it's not a big discount but obviously we, we, we can't expect too much during these these difficult times but we've got a five percent discount now with um, a great company where I, I get all my treats from and that's a company called fine up by nature so i have arranged for us all to have a five percent discount with them um i will be posting the code um in the group but if anybody's got a pen and they want to take a note of it now 
the discount code is FBN, so F for Freddy or Finer, B for Bravo or Buy, and N for Norman or Nature. So Finer by Nature. Um, I will pop their web address um, in the group as well. So we've, we've got a little discount, just a little 5% one, but something's better than nothing during these times, I think. So huge thanks to Gary and the team um, over there um, for giving us that little discount. We really appreciate it. Um, we Last Saturday, I posted the um, the Lou Roll Challenge, the Lou Roll Relay. The Lou I loved them all. That was so much fun to put together, everybody. Um, and just as I posted uh, the completed video, I had some more videos sent through. So I'm going to put together another Lou Roll Relay video for everybody. So if you want to do it again or you didn't um, manage to get onto the Lou Roll Challenge the last time, just let me know. Send me a video in and I will pop you onto the, the rest of the videos that I've got lined up. If you're not sure what the Lou Roll Challenge is, just scroll back uh, through some of the videos and you'll see that from last Saturday. So the date was last Saturday. What was that last Saturday? Um, last Saturday, it was the 25th. So have a quick look at the post on the 25th of April um, and, and look for the video there on Saturday morning. The Lou Roll Challenge. Um, we are so close to 750 members. So, 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 so close. Uh, so let's get as many people added into the group that you think might benefit. Even if you don't know anybody um, specifically that might benefit from being in the group, they are, they are Tilly. So, yep, yeah, do they? That's fantastic. There you go. See, look, you've got 5% off now, Tilly. Woohoo! There you go. Enjoy. Um, we're so, so close to that 750 members mark. So, remember, as soon as we've got there, I've got a big list of everybody that's in the group so far. And uh, in an Excel spreadsheet, I will add on any new people that join until we get to that 750 number. And as soon as we do, I will, um, I don't know, find some sort of clever app or something online that can scroll through those names and pull out a winner. And that winner will, no, that's all right, see you later, bye-bye. Um, we will see who can uh, who can win that free access to Pause Online for the next month. And there is actually, you're going to be getting a huge bargain because not only are you going to get the regular stuff in Pause Online, but also... That's where my Bark Busters is going to be as well in Pause Online. So you're not only going to be getting everything that's normally involved in Pause Online, so the puppy stuff, any other Q&A things you may have, you're also going to get Bark Busters. So that's going to be an absolutely amazing prize for somebody, as well as all the other bits and bobs that I've put in there. So that's going to be fantastic. So let's get to 750 members. Of course, you do know that once we get to 750, I'm going to can't get to 1,000. But, you know, that's the whole point of having a challenge and building this this canine community i just want to be there for everybody both during these these times and after because this is my passion this is what i want to do is i want to make sure that every dog and their owner is as happy as can be that is my absolute ethos that everybody's got to be happy um so i want to really build this this brilliant community where everybody just knows where they can go for any sort of support tips advice or even just fun that's what it's all going to be about so anybody do just tag them add them invite them just even a share a little share of a post it might just get someone to say oh actually that might be of use to me and we might be able to help somebody or bring a smile to their day so please do any of the little jokes or, or random posts i put up then do just just please feel free to share them um and then finally just in case um, i know that um there's lots of people with puppies out there um, I've got my Golden Paws Club, um, again, for the puppies. Um, I've got a great new, um, it, I suppose it's it's not quite a book, but it's a booklet coming out um, very shortly um, in the Paws Online. In fact, I may have posted it all, I may have put it in there already. I think I have. Um, so a great book, booklet on puppy teething at the moment and also a training book for um, puppies and children. So if you've got... Um, your kids at home at the moment and you've got your new puppy um i've actually got a book uh, especially being made at the moment um for helping your kids really become involved in in helping build the most amazing puppy uh, to, to join your family and build up into the most amazing dog so that's all going to be part of pause online or i will be selling those books separately as well if you know anybody that would be interested in them um, so that's about it from me that I wanted to quickly cover because it's been a really manic 
exciting week actually since since I've got everything sorted and I've been able to get things back going because I've been sitting down with beans a lot I've been sort of making lots of notes oh I could do this I could do that I could do this um oh and then we've got bark busters coming up um as well so um I asked everybody what they needed help with and so many of you are struggling with barking and I hear you on that one quite little well, just about because the definitely I'm not that deaf quite yet from my dog's barking so I thought we'd actually do a real life four week training session alongside me and my dogs um, so we can actually do this together. The puppet. Oh, I love that, Tilly. I love it. I love it, oh, Pam. I love it, Pam. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. That is a puppet. I love it. Um, so, yeah, when it comes to um, that barking, I'm actually going to work through it with you. I've got four terriers, four terriers that think that even the sound of a butterfly flapping its wings outside um, needs to be barked at. So, um, anything like that um those bark busters do come along do come along and join in with that and again um it might sound like a lot of money but it really it really isn't um for what you're going to be getting we're going to actually be working alongside each other as a team uh fixing this problem uh, while we're at home um, if we are didn't you don't have to be at home during this time it's going to help them while you're at home because we can help build those new habits but it's going to be a really fun little adventure with everybody over those four weeks to see what we can achieve within that time. So, no worries, Wendy, see you later. Um, so yeah, does anybody have any any other training issues at the moment? I don't know how many people are, are in and watching, unfortunately, it doesn't it doesn't tell me. Um, but if anybody has any questions, I'll just open this up to a little bit of Q&A at the moment, just give it a minute in case anybody's here or not. Um, and if you do, um, just pop them in the comments there, I'll just refresh that for a minute or so. Otherwise, I shall love you and leave you for a Friday night. And that's another Friday night with him. Um, yes, yeah, so we've got some cool, cool stuff coming up. So um, basically, yeah, it's going to be really exciting. So it's all nice and quiet in the group, hopefully. I'll just give it another few seconds. Otherwise, I shall love you and leave you to your Friday night. Oh, we've got the quiz night next Saturday. That's going to be lots of fun. I'm not quite sure how I'm going to run that just yet. I think I'm just going to have to trust you to sort of write your answers down on pieces of paper and everything like that um so that will that will be a lot of fun um but yeah I, i'm not quite not quite figured it out yet but we will we will get there we will get there that'll be a fun night next uh, saturday night and then i'd also want to do some bingo as well do some bingo nights and everything like that really really get you all going yeah nice to see you too amanda um so yeah i will see you all very soon um for lots of fun games for you and your dog now let's 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 bring us all together um, especially at the end of the day when we've been having lots of fun with our dogs. Maybe it's time for just a glass of wine and uh, a, a nice quiz or some bingo. So I will see you all later. Thank you for joining me and uh, take care and I will see you soon. Bye, everybody. Take care.